Hello students, so in today's video we are going to discuss MCQs from chapter number 3 metals and non-metals. These MCQs are very important for your exam purposes. So let's start with question number 11 as we have already discussed till question number 10 in previous video. Metals can be beaten into thin sheet. This quality of metal is called option A malleability, option B ductility, option C sonorous, option D brittleness. So the answer is option number A malleability. Question number 12. Which of the following is non-metal? Option A sodium, option B potassium, option C lithium, option D bromine. The answer would be D bromine. Question number 13. Non-metals which is liquid at room temperature. Option A O2, option B Cl, option C, H2, option D, Br. That would be option number D, Br, which is bromine. Let's move to question number 14. Metals that can be cut with knife. Option A, sodium. Option B, potassium. Option C, lithium. Option D, all of these. So as all of them can be cut with the help of knife, then the answer would be option number D, all of the above. Let's move to question number 15. This metal does not react with oxygen. Option number A, magnesium. Option number B, sodium. Option number C, potassium. Option number D, gold. That would be option number D, gold, which is AU. Let's move to question number 16. Which metal is most reactive of the following? Option A, aluminium. Option B, Fe, which is iron. C, lead. Option number D is copper. So the answer is option A, aluminium. Let's move to question number 17. School bell is made of metal. Why? Due to which quality of metal? Option A, sonorous. Option B, ductility. Option C, hard. Option D, good conductor. So the answer would be option A, sonorous, which is the property of a metal to create sounds. Let's move to question number 18. Which ions metal make? Option number A, positive. Option number B, negative. Option number C, both. Option number D, none of these. So the answer is A, positive. Let's move to question number 19. Metals normally give falling gases with dilute acid. Option A, H2. Option B, O2, option C, CO2, option D, NO2. The answer is option number A, H2. Question number 20. Which of the following is amphoteric oxide? So amphoteric oxide are basically substance that react with both acids and bases. The answer would be option number C, Al2O3. So that is it for today's video. If you like it, then give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.